All right, the winter tender project. So I spent the last couple of weeks working with a bunch of tenders, trying to match up tenders with correct locomotives or change tenders to something that is more correct than what I had without spending a ton of money like is very easy to do with model trains. So I took my 224 tender that I had and put the correct draw bar back on it. Um, I had used this tender with my Lionel 226, which wasn't correct, but I would rather have had it on a 226 so I could use that locomotive. So the 224 tender, correct, back on its 224, which meant I had to get a new tender to work with the 226. So I had this MTH tender. Um, I had rubber stamped American Flyer lines and I was having it pulled by my American Flyer Hudson. But it's a 12 wheel tender. It doesn't have some of the nickel handrails on the front and the back like the Lionel one did. And the trucks and coupler are different. Lionel's 226 tender had a box coupler on the back was not my favorite thing. I don't have many trains with box couplers and I would rather have the knuckle so I could use my 226 to pull a lot of things in my, my collection. So I built another draw bar to connect to the 226, painted the whole thing flat black, had this wonderful Chesapeake and Ohio rubber stamp that I hadn't used yet. So rubber stamp with Chesapeake and Ohio. I even made a little rubber stamp of the CNO on the back. So not the correct Lionel lines like it's supposed to have, but I didn't feel like spending $200 on a tender when I had one that I could just kind of repaint, restamp, and it's pretty correct in size and shape. Up front, I got a Silver Streak to be pulled by the Lionel 265, but I didn't have the correct tender. It has to have this little round connector on the back and another round one on the front this tender can only get used to pull the silver streak so i took a tender that was trashed got silver grab rails nice lionel lines on the back it's got its little round lionel disc i got a silver one put silver ladder on so that it can pull my silver streak and i can finally get that running the way it needs to be run this is a long-term project, but this is a tender for an MTH Greenbrier. I had the shell. It didn't have a frame, so I took two Lionel, or sorry, MTH S2 turbine frames that I had that I wasn't using, cut them, welded them, added these wonderful eight wheel trucks, even though the Greenbrier only had six wheel trucks, I had these laying around and proportionately they look correct. So this will eventually will be pulled by my Greenbrier if I can build a chassis to go with the Greenbrier shell that I have. The fun one was the redo on my American Flyer Hudson. So American Flyer had two different tenders that it pulled. It had a long square tender that had four wheel trucks or it had a tender with 12 trucks that looked a lot like the MTH one that it used to pull. But I wasn't very happy with how aesthetically it looked since I had to use this Lionel truck on the back of the Hudson because mine was missing. Wouldn't it be cool if I could just tie that all the way through? So this is an MTH S2 turbine shell that I had as a spare. Not thinking a long term ahead, it had a chassis frame, but I cut it apart for my Greenbrier. So I had to make another frame to go underneath. So this is flat sheet brass. And then I welded or soldered on some brass washers and through the brass washers, drilled my holes to attach my trucks. Mounted a hook on the back. It needed to drop a bunch, so I used an old um, bulb holder and came down through that. That ended up working. Stamped it with American Flyer lines. 
and on the back added its cute little 1680 to match the 1680 that I put on my locomotive. But it ended up being the same height and the lines matched and it came out looking pretty amazing and I had all the parts laying around. So my 2024 with correct tender, Greenbrier coming, American Flyers pulling this wonderful streamlined tender that was scrap parts. The Silver Streak tender completed and my 226 pulling a nice little MTH. So a couple more projects coming soon, but the great winter tender project.